pitchers know that much of the time they are going to make contact and put the ball in play. Making the routine plays as well as some spectacular ones is expected at the big league level. This week, some Yankees talk about why they take so much pride in their defense and why it takes so much hard work to stand out in the field. The Yankees have great defensive players virtually everywhere you look, starting with their infield, where Derek Jeter, Brian Roberts, and Mark Teixeira have all won gold gloves over the course of their careers. They know that their defense can be just as important as their offense. It's a triple play. And when you're going through a, a slump, um, you know, maybe you can save your pitcher some runs in the outfield. Maybe I'm not going to hit a bases clearing double every single time I'm up, but um, I take that hit away as the first hitter of the inning, and you got one out and nobody on. You know, that's kind of a rally killer as opposed to, you know, the speedy guy getting on. Uh, something I take a lot of pride in is my defense, being able to cover a lot of ground and, and keep some guys off the bases and help the pitchers out. And, it's, a, it's an area of my game where I feel like um, it doesn't necessarily slump. One player in particular who has dazzled in the field in his brief time with the Yankees is backup infielder Brendan Ryan. Known largely as a defensive specialist, we have watched him make great play after great play. His talent is enhanced by the amount of work he puts into his craft. Defense is fun and you can just uh, have an impact, such an impact with, with effort and paying attention and these guys put together amazing scouting reports. In the outfield, the Yankees possess one of the speediest tandems. That makes pitchers breathe easier, knowing that they are all quite capable of running down many balls headed for the gap. Defense is overlooked sometimes and you know I think it's definitely important, especially in Yankee Stadium when we're playing at home, to have some speed in the outfield. You know, it's one of the biggest left fields in all of baseball and, and left center. Left center is pretty big, center field is pretty big. Yeah, the ball's hitting the gap, you're trying to cut it off as quick as possible. Um, there may be runners on, and you're, you're, you already know the speed of the runners, where they're at. From there, you have to read, read, the, read the runner. Uh, you never know, maybe you slipped, fell, uh, got a bad read, so that'll dictate where you throw the ball. But you know, ultimately, you're just trying to hit your cutoff man in the chest, and uh, you know, hopefully he'll make a you know, solid throw wherever he needs to go. It is an underrated part of the game, but perhaps the most important, certainly in tight run affairs. The Yankees certainly boast more than their fair share of players who can flash the kind of leather that can keep other teams off the scoreboard.